Hey everyone, so I'm back today with my Booktubeathon day one update and video challenge. It is currently day two. I didn't have time on day one yesterday to film my video because I literally worked from 4 p.m. to 12.30 a.m. and I had to stay until 1 because not everything was done. So I only got a couple hours of reading time yesterday and I only read 56 pages of The Spectacular Now by Tim Tharp. This book is my book to movie adaptation read where you read the book and you watch the movie. I only read about 56 pages of it and then when I got home I read some more but that is in the day two update because it was after midnight and yeah I just hope to finish this today I have I think it's like four o'clock or something right now. Uh, I don't know when this is going up but obviously it's going up later today. So yeah, I hope to finish this today. So that's what I read in day one. Honestly, I didn't read a lot because I was really busy with work. But today I had the day off and tomorrow I have the day off. So hopefully I can read a lot. But now let's get on to the video challenge. Day one's video challenge was to show your top three books that you read because of booktube. The first one I have to show you was actually, I believe, the first book I remember seeing on booktube and buying and that was like three years ago I'm pretty sure around that because I started booktube around three years ago and it was one of the first first books I got because of booktube and that is Jellico Road by Melina Marchetta it is amazing and so so good I loved everything about this book and it is uh, actually I think all the ones I have to show you are contemporaries which is awesome. My sister read this as well and she loved it and even got her own copy because she loved it so much. The next book I have is Anna and the French Kiss by Stephanie Perkins. I read this book in a day when I got it and I got it because of booktube otherwise I wouldn't be showing it to you in this video. Yeah I read it in a day and it's like close to 400 pages. Yeah, it was so, so, so good. I still have yet to read Lola and the Boy Next Door, and I think the third one just recently ca came out, or is coming out soon. Then the last book I have to show you is Eleanor and Park by Rainbow Rowell. This was the first El <laughs> this was the first Rainbow Rowell book I have ever read, and I absolutely adored it, and now I am currently reading Landline, but I'll pick that again up again after Booktubeathon. So those were my top three books I read because of booktube and my day one update. I hope you all enjoyed it. I will see you again tomorrow to update you on today's progress. <laughs> see ya.